A very revealing interview with Kelly Osborne. She's opening up to British Cosmopolitan about her drug addiction and just how far her beloved mother went to save her daughter's life. ABC's Bianca Goladriga has the story. Kelly Osborne has always had a close relationship with her mother, Sharon. Now the Fashion Police co-host opens up in the September issue of British Cosmo, which hits newsstands Friday, about how her mother supported her through her various stints in rehab and the lengths Sharon went to to get her off drugs. My mom even had me put in a padded cell once to scare me, but like a brat, I just sat it out until she said, well, that's not going to work. But what I've learned is that no amount of therapy or medication is going to work unless you want it to. It's so raw and honest for her to speak in that way. And you really feel for her and Sharon's battle as well, because for a mother to see her daughter so desperate. Kelly Osborne spoke with me two months ago about what finally made her come clean and turn her life around. I was sick and tired of not liking myself and believing what everyone said about me, because I thought, well, if they say that I'm a drug addict. Why don't I just be that then? Sharon Osborne was diagnosed with cancer back in 2002. The 28 year old revealed she had to choose between a coveted movie role or caring for her mother. I was faced with the choice of a career or spending what could have been the last days of my mother's life with her. I became my mom's nurse 24 7. Osborne opened up about her mother's decision to get a mastectomy. It's a huge, huge decision and you have to be very brave to go through that. I know you've been vocal about your mom being your best friend. She's bloody annoying, but she is my best friend. <laughs> Osborne recently got engaged to longtime boyfriend Matthew Mosshart and wants to start a family one day, telling the magazine, I want kids, a boy and a girl. When I do, I will not have a baby call me mom. I'm in no rush, though. For Good Morning America, Bianca Goladriga, ABC. ABC News, New York.